Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo, located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2016 Kia Sorento EX. Now the most suitable features on this EX is its heated front seats. You also have your blind spot monitoring and your backup camera. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2016 Kia Sorento EX. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Sorento is its daytime running lights and then if you take a closer look you'll see your hood deflector and over on the side you have your 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels. You also have your integrated signal lamps as well as your foldable mirrors and then if you take a look on the inside of the mirror you'll see your blind spot warning indicator. Now with that blind spot warning indicator it'll actually light up just learning that there's another vehicle right beside you. You also have the window visor guards, and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is gray. And to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black leather into your seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Over on your left hand side, you're going to see your blind spot monitoring on and off as well as your traction control. And then on the inside of the driver's side door, you'll see your seat memory controls for your driver one and two. Power folding mirrors, mirror controls, power locks, window locks, and window controls. Taking a look at the steering wheel, you'll see you have your volume control, voice recognition mode select, seek function, as well as your Bluetooth cruise control. And you do have the push button start, so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now, if we take a look at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on here. So, as you can see, you have your service in here. You can also go through your settings. You have your speedometer through here as well with your range as well as your trip info. And then you'll also find a couple of other additional features in here as well. As you can also go through your audio on here as well. Now, taking a look at your center dash as well as your display, you'll see a couple of different features on here which include your AM, FM, as well as your CD player. You do have your satellite radio on here. Taking a look just down below here, you're going to find the dual zone climate control settings with your hazard lights, heated seat controls for your driver and passenger with three different settings along with your heated steering wheel. Now down below that, you'll find the USB and auxiliary input with your power outlet. And it's matted to a automatic transmission. You'll also find your drive mode as well as your all-wheel drive lock and your rear parking sensors on and off. Now, taking a look just at the top here, you're going to find your auto dimming rear view mirror with your digital compass. And if we scroll down to the bottom here, I'm just going to show you what your backup camera looks like. So as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you try to back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate now located on your rear bumper. You're going to see your parking sensors just located right across. On the back of the tailgate, you'll find your backup camera just on your left-hand side. Rear hatch release located underneath your Kia emblem. And taking a look in the rear cargo space here, as you can see, you do have the cargo cover in the back, which is nice because if you want to cover up your valuables just while you're going from place to place, you have the option of doing so. You also have your rear folding seats just in case you need some more additional space. And if we take a look just underneath the floor here, as you can see, you have tons of room just back here as well. And underneath the floor, just at the front, you'll find your jack and tool kit, as well as some under the floor storage space. So if you do find yourself in need of some uh, storage space, it is available to you. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this 2016 Kia Sorento EX, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sbtoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.